Well, we got Chris Jensen, a young star from the Grand Ole Opry. He's going to be here Saturday performing from 6 to about 8.30. We'd like to invite everybody out, bring your family. They won't be in charge for children. Part of the proceeds is going to go to the Wicksburg Seniors. This is be Sue's birthday, Saturday. We named the lake after my daughter, Patty Sue Mathis, who's deceased. This property behind me here used to be Buzzard Bay. That's what everybody called it. And I purchased the property from the Casey Brothers Lumber Company in Dothan, Alabama. I got a permit from the Corps Engineer to build a dam across where my property line is. Then we stocked it, but we had problems with trash fish, eat, trash fish eating our game fish. So we drained the lake, we came back and dug it out. It's 70 acres in size. We've got it restocked. We've had it stocked about two years. we got brim, shellcracker, bass, and catfish in it. We're going to open the lake up for fishing to the public on Saturday week, which will be the 14th. And we hope everybody will come, bring your kids, and have a good time. we got it cleaned up around the edge so everybody can see what's happening. And uh, we're looking forward to it. We've got this old house here. We moved over here. We've got it fixed up, and we're going to rent it out for people have weddings or special events. We right now finishing up outside there in case people want to camp. We're fish, finishing up two restrooms and they'll have a place they can take a shower. And down on the lake is the Naughty Lady. That's a houseboat I found down in Florida. We're putting electricity, water, and sewer to the Naughty Lady. And what we're going to have is a the bride might want to spend the night on the naughty lady, who knows. Well, I used to fish in this thing when I was little, and it would dry up, and, and sometimes it would be full of water. And I've always dreamed, of, of course, I didn't own the property then, but I, I dreamed of putting a lake here, and uh, it's finally come about. We've been working on it a pretty good while, but I was just trying to have something to people to remember my daughter. Right, part of the, part of the funds from, from the concert is going to go to the Wicksburg Seniors. Sue, she's a senior citizen director there, and we've uh, purchased them a couple of vans in our lifetime, so we, we plan on sharing our proceeds with them.